EA have released this fast forward evolution. Now, it makes every 64 or under player get an absolutely huge boost. Looking at some of the players we can select already, for example, this guy here, it's going to make him into an 89 rated center back with the radioactive chem style and giving him a crazy boost overall. We're going to go through all of the best options. So we're going to have to make our way over to a website called foot.gg. And as you can see on this website here, there are a few players that you can put in overall. Now, judging from the prices of some of them, for example, this at Libertador is 8,000 coins, 3,000. The guy that I have is 10,000. We're going to kind of base it off that a little bit and then break down certain things. We're only going to go through the major leagues, so the top five leagues. So I'll probably miss a few that aren't in here. For example, this Belgium guy from the Belgium League. But I will link this website in the comment section down below if you want to check that out and make it out for yourself. So starting off in the Premier League, we're going to make our way over to Chambers. Now, if we back off for one second, see here Chambers is a bronze. And if you have kept your Pep's legacy, you can make him 92 rated. But we're just going to look at fast forward to now. And as you can see, really good acceleration and sprint speed. He can play center back and left back. He's left back naturally and be a center back. Left footed with 83 short pass. Really good defensive stats overall. Fantastic agility and balance for somebody that's going to be a center back. We've had to put a shadow on him. He's going to give him 90 pace and 91 defending as well as 94 interceptions, really good slide and stand tackle, as you can see. And it's just going to make him into a monster of a card. Now, I do like this. You are going to be looking at a price of him at around 9,000 coins, so I highly recommend you do Bronze Pack Method. If you don't know what that is, I will be uploading a video on this channel straight afterwards to explain how it works. But we are going to move on to our next player, which is going to be another player from the Premier League. Again, Murphy. You can see here, centre-back. They can play left-back. He has a four-star weak foot as well. And if we have a look at his evolution, not as quick as the other cards. I will mention that. But again, as a center back with five star weak foot, really good rounded defensive stats. You don't have to worry about links because he gets a plus two on league and nation. Yes, not many people have um, Irish players, but obviously Premier League is going to be fantastic. We had to put a shadow on him. It's going to give him 80 pace, 93 defending. Acceleration and sprint speed is going to be really, really good. And he is also mostly lengthy, which means he's going to get quicker over time as he runs. So that pace kind of counteracts itself and gets you in a really good position. And I really like the look of this Murphy card. I will tell you which one I'm going to take near the end for me personally. But again, with the price of this card at the minute in time, about 6000 So it's a little bit cheaper. You can see there, but again, you get it for bronze pack methods. These are common as well, so much easier to get if you like. We are going to move over to our next player, which is going to be in the Serie A. And it's going to be a Spanish centre-back. Two-star, three-star. Could play only play centre-back. Low, medium work rate. And you can see here, with this, he turns into an absolute monster. Spanish from the Serie A is absolutely amazing for links. Or links, even, sorry, for chemistry. But he has 92 short pass, 89 long pass. Again, with a shadow, gives him 90 pace, 95 defending, 93 acceleration. He is controlled lengthy, which is not the best. But again, you won't really worry about it too much. Really good acceleration. Uh, sorry, agility and balance as well, 83 and 92. But look at these defender stats. He's got 1, 2, 3 over 99. Yes, stand tackle, slide tackle is an amazing but header and accuracy is really good. Defensive awareness at 90, 91 interceptions. Mentioned the passing already. Even good stamina, strength, and 99 jump in for a guy. If we were to have a look at his height ever so quickly and his price, it's around 10,000 coins, and he is standing at six foot one and 185 centimeters. So this guy is an absolute monster. That's why his price is what it is. Moving back into the Serie A again, we've got a different card. We've got center mid. Now he is French. Two-star, four-star. Yes, the balance isn't amazing. We'll have a look at his height in a minute. But as a CDM with 94 short pass, 89 long pass, you can go for many things. A shadow is going to get him to 89 pace. But look at those stats overall. 89, 82, 84, 93, and 88. Four-star weak foot, medium-medium work rates. He can also play centre-back and CDM if you need him to drop there. But as a, as a DM in front of your defence, or if you're one of these people to play five at the back, he's going to be really good for you in that. You could argue the stamina isn't amazing for the CDM role, so it's something you have to be careful with. But even if you wanted to push him up a little bit forward, you could have a look at Gladiator, for example. Boost up that shooting a little bit, but mainly boost up that defending. Same for a Guardian. Get that dribbling and defending up to maximize agility and balance. Or we could even look at an engine, which is going to do the same thing, but also type up his pace. But if we were to go for a shadow, you can see here it makes him mostly lengthy, which is unbelievably good for a CDM. 
or a centre back for those recoveries and breaking through. And again, being French, really easy to link. Being Serie A, also very easy to link. If we were to look at his base card at the moment, you can see he's about 6,000 coins. He's six foot two, so 187 centimetres. He is a big, big player. And he will dominate that defense for you if you are especially newer to the game. Stop right there with the introduction of kits, tokens, and now evolutions needed FC points or coins to complete them. There is no better time than to head over to IGDM.com. Get yourself some coins. Very, very cheap, fast, and reliable. Use discount code NANIC at the store and get 5% off. The link will be in the description. Moving on to our next one is going to be in the Bundesliga. Now, we have gone for an Italian this time. And he is a centre back, a centre back only. With this play style, is going to give, or this evolution is going to give a four star weak foot. But really rounded card. You can see really good agility and balance, really good rounded defence, fantastic strength, jump in, stamina, etc. Really good acceleration and sprint speed. And then we were to put a shadow on him on top. 90 pace again, 93 defending, 84 physical. All of his stats here, 93, 95, 95, 90, 89, 88 and 91. Controlled lengthy is what you want as well. As an Italian, if you're running like a Serie A team and you're looking for a good defender, for somebody of this card who can then link to hyperlink teams like Bundesliga, etc., you've got yourself many, many options in that situation. And then you can see here, looking at his price, he's 5,000 coins. He's not that much. Six foot one, 186 centimeters tall. So he's a nice height. JT and balance isn't going to be very good in terms of bronzes, but with that upgrade we saw there, it gives him a really nice boost. We're going to move on to our next one, which is going to be in the Bundesliga again. We have gone for a Belgium CDM slash centre back. Now, this card looks fantastic as a playmaker CDM because he's got 85 short pass, 84 long pass. Very good defensive stats overall. Really good agility and balance as well. Fantastic stamina. Good acceleration and sprint speed. If we were to put a shadow on him, gives him 91 pace, 93 defending, 84 physical, 80, uh, sorry, 80 physical, 84 dribbling. And as a CDM in the middle of your team, this guy is going to be an absolute menace in what he can offer. And you can see here just how good his defensive stats become. 96 interception, really high stand and slide tackle. Of course, the pace goes up as well. But if you didn't like that, you could look at an engine to give him 90 agility and very high balance, as you can see here as well. Boost up that pace, boost up that passing a little bit more. He's not going to be scoring goals, but he is going to offer you so much more. Could go for a Guardian, of course, 91 dribbling, 93 defending. And the same for a Gladiator with defending if you want to boost up that shoot a little bit. But that 41 finishing, I think, is kind of like a waste of time. Got an anchor as well. There are many, many options. And we have a look at the price of this card. You can see here he's coming at 3,800. He's six foot one. Medium, medium work rate, you could argue, isn't amazing. But still, with those boosts, it's going to be unbelievably good. And then we're going to move over to League 1. Now, there isn't many choices in there. I've gone for this guy here. Okay, he is a French centre-back. And you can see here, low, medium, two-star, three-star. But overall, really good acceleration, sprint speed, fantastic agility and balance for a centre-back. Good short pass. Reminds me of Maldini in many ways in terms of statistics. We go ahead and put the shadow on. 93 pace as a centre back, 93 defence, 87 physical, mostly lengthy. You can see here all of his statistics 99, 99, 96 interceptions. With this agility and balance, this guy is going to be amazing, especially being French from Ligue 1. You already have the links. He's going to give you plus two on everyone that's French and everybody from Ligue 1. So you can have a crazy good team with him in that. If we were to look at his price, you can see here 8,600 coins. He's six foot two and 189 centimeters. So he's very, very big with that high agility and balance. And that leads us to our last one, who I'm personally going to do. It's going to be from La Liga. I'm not going to try and pronounce it. I'm going to call him Alina. But look at these stats. 91 agility, 93 balance. Defensive stats are absolutely outstanding. The 95 defensive awareness, 96 interceptions. Really good stamina aggression. 86 short pass, 89 long pass. And then we put a shadow on. Gives him 88 pace, but 99 interceptions, 99 defensive awareness. All of his defender stats are 92 or higher. Mixed in with this 91 and 93 agility and balance. Four-star weak foot. He can play left back or right back as well as center back as well. And if we have a look at his card, it is 10,000 coins extinct for the reason of how good he is. But you can see he's six foot, low high work rates as well. This guy is the one I think you need to do if you're looking for meta. But like I said, I may have missed a few off this list for obvious reasons. There's Libertador. 
Soros card everyone seems to be looking at. Belgium League have a good one. We've got some championship players as well, as well as some other La Liga, the Women's League, and much more. So make sure you have a look at this first before you go through it. If you have any questions, let me know. And most importantly, let me know which one you are going for, and I'll catch you in the next one.